Welcome to RF Online, your e-banking portal. To access the portal, you first have to activate your e-banking account. Before you get started, you will need your RF Online welcome email, your cell phone with an Authenticator app installed, and a secondary device, such as a laptop, desktop, or tablet. Your online security is really important to us. To keep your account secure, you need a one-time password from an Authenticator app each time you log in. To access RF Online, you will first need to set up this OTP using an Authenticator app of your choice. To do this, use your secondary device to open the welcome email and navigate to the RF self-service website. Enter the username and password from the welcome email and click the login button. Once you've logged in, another email will automatically be sent to you providing a second password. Enter this password on the self-service site as directed. Next, click Create to set up your token. You will be prompted to download an Authenticator app. You can disregard this step if you already have one or scan the QR code with your cell phone. This will take you to your app store where you can install one. Once you have the Authenticator installed, Click Next. Enter a name for your token so it's easily identifiable, like RF Bank. Click Create Token. Use your cell phone, open the Authenticator app, and scan the QR code. Your phone will now display a six-digit password that you can enter into the OTP value on your secondary device. Click Verify to continue. You have now successfully created your token to use your Authenticator app when logging in to RF Online. Now, you can access the RF Online portal. Sign out of the RF self-service site. You won't need to log in there again. Navigate to RF Online. You can do this by clicking the link in your welcome email, clicking the brokerage login button on the website, or by typing digibank.rfgroup.com into your web browser. Enter the RF Online username and password from your welcome email. Use the Authenticator app on your phone to get the one-time password and click Login. Next, you will be asked to choose a new password to use going forward when accessing your account. Type in the existing password, your new chosen password, and then re-enter to confirm. Finally, enter the OTP from your app and click Continue. And there you are, your online banking is set up and ready to use.